This is um, Fumi Bonk right here from the Big Island. Uh, Fumi Bonk is from Hilo, uh, originally from Hilo, but she lives in Kamuela now, and she's my mother, and she's asked me to come up here and speak for her and told me what to say. She, um, she's been getting calls from the Big Island uh, a lot this week, uh, including a call from Moani Ke'ala Okaka, a former uh, OHA trustee for 12 years. Moani was a trustee for, the Hawaii, for Hawaii Island. And to go on record, um, both my mother and Moani Ke'ala Okaka want to go on record uh, informing the PLDC that they uh, went back on their promise to have hearings on the Big Island after they made changes to the rules and regulations for the PLDC. They had promised the Big Island people that they would be back to have a public hearing, and they feel slighted that you didn't go back to do that, and you're doing it on the law so that the people of the outer islands do not have a fair um, opportunity to comment on, on this body, this corporation. So um, I brought with it to put on record uh, an article that uh, Moana Keala Kaka has written on the PLDC in her um, uh, newspaper called Omaha Aina, and I'll present that to you. Um, she's already stated why she's opposed to this, and my mother and father, who is uh, deceased, have spent their whole entire lives, not just on the Big Island, but through the state, working for cultural preservation and archaeological preservation of Hawaiian artifacts and, and um, uh, history. My father served on the DLNR board for historical sites preservation, and if he was alive today, he'd be appalled at this whole um, circuit. Um, my mother came today to represent him and his philosophy on good public planning and on good um, conservation of the environment, but in particular, their work to preserve the history of Hawaii. This goes against every process that we have in place in Hawaii. And you know, um, I, I'm Sorry to say that um, the creation of Act 55 was just encouraged by many developers who have other private interests in contributing large sums of money to our public officials to do projects, special projects to them. Moani and my mother wanted to assert the fact that there have been a lot of fights on the Big Island with developers coming in and wanting to um, fast track development without the public's participation. One in particular that they know has been earmarked for this particular corporation's uh, agenda is Honokahau. The project in Honokahau has been boycotted and fought for many, many decades. The people have spoken. They don't want it. And here you come with another little developer um, plot and scheme to force it back into their face. They have a lot of better things to do on the Big Island, like community-based economic development projects that are going on all around that island. If you really want to help, eliminate this, put all the funds into communities, and let them decide what they want to do. And that's coming from the Big Island. That's all I do. Um, that's about it. Mom, do you have anything else to say? Do you have anything else to say? God damn you. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.